What's up, Fi, everyone? Welcome to the very first episode of Recon Jack. I'm your host, U.S. Marine veteran and historian Chuck Lynch. What better topic for this introductory episode than to talk about the very first United States Marine recipient of the Medal of Honor? The Medal of Honor is not only the highest and most prestigious U.S. military decoration, but also remains the oldest continuously issued combat decoration of the United States Armed Forces. The Medal of Honor was introduced for the Department of the Navy in 1861, soon followed by the Department of the Army's version in 1862. Therefore, during the American Civil War, when first awarded, just like today, Marines, as a Department of the Navy, are presented with the Navy's version of the Medal of Honor. On 9 December 1861, Iowa Senator James W. Grimes, Chairman on the Committee on Naval Affairs, submitted Bill S-82 during the second session of the 37th Congress, an act to further promote the efficiency of the Navy. The bill included a provision for 200 Medals of Honor to be bestowed upon such petty officers, seamen, landsmen, and marines as shall most distinguish themselves by their gallantry in action and other seamen-like qualities during this present war. On 21 December, the bill was passed and signed into law by President Abraham Lincoln. Secretary of the Navy Gideon Wells directs a Philadelphia Mint to design the newly approved military decoration. On 15 May 1862, the United States Department of the Navy orders 175 medals at $1.85 each from silversmith William Wilson and Son at the U.S. Mint in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania with the inscription, Personal Valor, on the back of each one. Now, let's talk about this awesome Marine. 15 May 1862, New York, New York native Corporal John Freeman Mackey becomes the very first United States Marine to receive the Medal of Honor for combat actions while on board the ironclad USS Galena in the attack on Confederate Marines shore batteries of Fort Darling at Drury's Bluff, which blocks the James River approach to Richmond, Virginia. Born 1 October 1835, Mackey enlists in the Marine Corps in New York on 24 April 1861. His first assignment is with the Marine Detachment on board the USS Savannah. He is soon promoted to the rank of Corporal on 1 March 1862. On 1 April, he begins serving on the ironclad warship USS Galena. On the morning of 15 May, a five-ship Union Navy squadron, including the Galena, steams up James River to test the defenses of the Confederate capital of Richmond, Virginia. Upon reaching a bend in the river upstream of Dutch Gap, the squadron encountered submerged obstacles and heavy fire from two battalion of Confederate Marines positioned on the banks of the river, as well as artillery fire from Fort Darling atop Drury's Bluff, about eight miles below Richmond. At the time, Mackey is commanding 12 Marines on the gun deck. Galena engages the Confederate position for over three hours until the ship's ammunition is nearly exhausted. The fort's artillery batteries begin to inflict severe damage on the Galena, estimating 44 hits on the port side. That's left side for you landlubbers out there, of which 13 hits penetrate the armor. This soon forces a Union squadron to turn back. During the battle, which becomes known as the Battle of Drury's Bluff, the majority of Galena's naval gun crew becomes casualties with 13 killed and 11 wounded. Mackey leads a group of Marines who take over operation of the guns for the remainder of the battle. He's promoted to orderly sergeant on 1 November and assigned to the USS Seminole in June 
1863. On 10 July, Mackey is awarded the Medal of Honor for his actions aboard the Galena on 15 May 1862. Ten days after his 28th birthday, on 11 October 1863, Mackey receives the medal via U.S. Postal Service mail while anchored off Sabine, Texas. He is presented the Medal of Honor, the Navy version, during a ceremony on the quarterdeck of the Seminole. Orderly Sergeant Mackey is later honorably discharged from the Marine Corps on 23 August 1865 in Boston, Massachusetts. Mackey eventually marries and settles near Philadelphia. He dies at the ripe old age of 74 and is buried in Arlington Cemetery in the Drexel Hill neighborhood of Upper Darby, Pennsylvania. Not the same Arlington Cemetery of much famous position in Virginia. At Drury's Bluff, now within Richmond National Battlefield Park, a historical marker is posted featuring Mackey's Medal of Honor action. His citation for the medal reads, The President of the United States of America, in the name of Congress, takes pleasure in presenting the Medal of Honor to Corporal John Freeman Mackey, United States Marine Corps, for extraordinary heroism in action on board the USS Galena in the attack at Fort Darling at Drury's Bluff, James River, on 15 May 1862. As enemy shell fire raked the deck of the ship, Corporal Mackey fearlessly maintained his musket fire against the rifle pits along the shore and when ordered to fill vacancies at guns caused by men wounded and killed in action, he manned the weapon with skill and courage. I hope you enjoyed the very first episode of Recon Jack and my own personal baptism of fire here on YouTube. Please stay tuned for more episodes as I continue to explore the hallowed history, traditions, and individuals of the United States Marine Corps. Also, please feel free to like that video, subscribe to my channel, and obviously leave a comment. I certainly look forward to reading your feedback. And until next time, Semper Fi and carry on.